Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Today is Lucky Tackle Box Day. I'm doing another unboxing for the XL Bass Box of Lucky Tackle Box. Uh, just got it in the mail minutes ago, and so we're gonna do it. Uh, this is for the month of November, guys. So without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, what we have is the Pencil 110, guys. And this is a walking style, it's like a spook. An all white color there. Let me take this out. You guys see that? And this retails at $13.99. There you go. Got some rattles in there, of course. Definitely gonna try that out. I'm pretty sure this thing cast a long mile. It's got some rattles in it. It's almost like a see-through. It's almost clear. I can see there's one little ball inside there. Again, that retails at $13.99. That's off. That's actually half, more than half of how much I paid for this box. <clears throat> Next up, we have the Bagley Pro Sunny B Lucky Tackle Box Edition exclusive crankbait. Check that out, guys. Pop that up for you. Definitely going to get my hands on this one. Pretty soon. Back with a, and it's a, it's a solid one, which is pretty good. There you go. It's kind of like a crawfish color. Does it have the color on the back? It does not, but it does say that the diving depth, this is three to six feet. <clears throat> this weighs a half ounce, and yes, the diving depth is three to six feet. So, and this is a, uh, from Lucky Tackle Box. There's supposed to be something new they're coming out with, and I guess their own line of uh, lures. So, that's awesome. Can't wait to try this thing out. Get it back in the package. Next up, we have some VMC <clears throat> Wheelis Nico Rig hooks here. There you go. You got your little we got them and we'll pop one out for you guys so you can check that out. Nico Rig hooks. Actually got them both out. There you go guys. Check it out. Hope you guys can see that. That's a little weedless thing here. Actually ooh, got my finger a little bit, but that's a nice little hook there for the Nico Rig. Something I have never ever fished before. I rigged it up before in a little underwater video footage of in my fish tank of how it looks, I've done it before. <clears throat> that way we'll never fish it, so. All right guys, next up we have the Boy Duckett BDJ 1115, well, 115, and this is a jerk bait. Perfect for this fall cold water conditions, and they got some nice hooks on there, I can see. Boy Duckett, they always come out with some pretty good hook, pretty good hooks on their lures. <clears throat> Diving depth is three to five feet be perfect 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 for shore fishing or on the bank or on a boat there you go awesome color nice 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 sturdy hooks and all different sizes we've got two the front hook here is one size and these other two are the same looks like be careful with these hooks, guys. They're very, very sticky. All right. Next up, <clears throat> six cents. We have a Cloud Nine C20. This is a big, big crankbait here. Diving depth 16 to 25 feet, and it's 1.6 ounces, 88 millimeters. Here we got, guys. 1.6 ounces weight. It's a big, big crankbait. I'm not gonna take that out the package, but as you see it there. Next up, we have some finesse TRD green pumpkin. And this I would definitely rig up on that either the Nico rig or the Net rig. This is actually made for the Net rig. There you go. Z Man's. They got some kill chatterbaits if you if you haven't noticed before in previous videos. Actually, I'll put a link in the description below for the my last video and other videos that I've used the Z-Man Project Z-Chatterbait. 
and the soft plastics are awesome. So this right here would be good for a net rig, and you could almost actually you could use it for a little drop shot, probably kind of wacky rig and drop shot it that way. Next up, last but not least, we have some Bass Attacker. Bass Attacker is pretty good, uh, pretty good company. I have some Bass Attacker uh, Elite Shiners that I use for trails on my. Uh, what's it called? Mm. Z-Man Shadow Base. So this here is infused with bass fuel. It's like a little Senko, Senko worm. This, this will be for the net rig right here. Put a little weight in one of the heads here. Put that nice little weedless hook on there and go to work on some of these fall bass guys. So. In the box, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven different things, all for $24.99. And let's go over the price really quick before I close out on this video. So, the Pro Sunny Lucky Tackle Box crankbait here, $12.99. All right, the Boy Ducket BD-115. $6.99. Then you got the Z Man TRD275 that retails at $3.99. Next up, we have the Bass Attacker here, $4.99. Then we have the Weedless Nico Rig Hooks, $3.99. And the Pencil here, $110. That retails at $13.99. And the six cents is big, massive crankbait right here. Retails at $8.99. So guys, I have well over the amount of money I paid for for this box. Um, if you haven't, I strongly suggest you go ahead and get out and subscribe to this company. You don't have to go with the Bass Box. You have, there are other options. Uh, you got Panfish Box and you know, I'm sure they might have small amount bass, small amount uh, boxes and stuff like that. So whatever your choice is, I just want to suggest you go ahead and subscribe and pay that $24.99 a month and get you a big old box, not a big box, but a nice size box for the lures every month shipped directly to your door. So guys, that's going to be it for this, uh, this episode, this unboxing for the Lucky Tackle Box um, XL unboxing for the month of November. As always, guys, like, comment, subscribe, share these videos if you like, and I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Peace.